what it is. I've never had this in a, in a bus thing before. Do you even physics, bro? It never happened. This th this isn't the stuff you're looking for, guys. It never happened. You didn't see that. loudest sea ever. The sea has microphone and speakers just to make sure you can hear it. Oh, this is a nice bus stop. It's like the detail on the mapping is actually pretty, pretty decent. This is cool. Kids playground. I have a WhatsApp, Dave. Don't tell me you sent me a picture of a beer. No, I know what it'll be. It'll be a picture of a beer and a kebab. Whoa. Bro, can you can you like put your stuff in the bin? That's neck or is it too far away for you? Kapak, thank you for two years. Looking forward to the next 10. Thank you very much, Kepek. Happy anniversary, mate. Enjoy your golden acorn. I don't know what Dave's done. I don't know what he's done. He's going to send me a picture of a beer. I knew it. So he's like, I poured one out for you. Just need you to pick me up. <laughs> I knew it. It's too early for a kebab. It's never too early for a kebab, Dave. Just get one now, and um, and Sarah can have hers when she gets home. You just microwave it. Just ding it when she comes in. And then you can say, I've made tea for you. I made you a kebab. And she's like, oh, I don't need to cook now. That's great. I can have a microwave kebab. You win, she wins. She's working nights. Well, she can eat her at 4 a.m. when she gets in. A good kebab before you get in bed. That's what you need. Wait, 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 wait. Mine, 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 mine. Didn't see that. The code can be found at my house if you know what to look for. You cannot miss it. It would have helped if he had left his name and then we know whose house we're actually looking for. Glorified Gamer. One month or three years. Have fun, I'll see you in the Twitch universe. Thank you, Glorified Gamer, for three years. Whoa, don't do that. Don't worry about this container. There's nothing in it. I have not Pepsi. I couldn't even install it. When I went to bed last night, you still couldn't install the darn thing. Have you looked at it? Jack, are the servers even back online yet?
gutted about Fallout 76. In what way? The hammering. I like the sound of that place. They should have called the gym there. The hammering. It's not... What? The servers are not online yet? Oh dear. That's not a good launch, is it? Uh, Costa collected a Foost. Then Antigua. Okay, there's Antigua. I don't know. Oh, it's here. Blimey. It's supposed to have North America and Oceania online later today. Right. I mean, you know, obviously EU money doesn't matter, right? <laughs> they haven't mentioned EU service. That's what I'm saying. Like, all the people like me, who live in the EU, who threw money at it, like, we don't care about you, let's bring America and Oceania up. I don't know if this sim's going to have multiplayer. I, I don't know. Yep, you just press tab to remove the mirrors like that. Or you can drag them around. To wherever you want them. Oh no, you can't drag them around apparently. Oh, you could drag them around. Interesting. No, re Revolver, that's that's not true. They're not all a scam. There's, um, there's a number of games that have been done properly. Creeper, they're all on max. Apart from the... The Bloom, I dialed back a bit, and the Light Rays, I dialed back a bit, but everything's on epic setting. early stages of multiplayer. In other words, it won't happen. <laughs> Apart from my throat, Doctor Exclusive, I'm okay. Oh boy! We may be off-roading, peeps! It's fine. It's fine. We got this. It's all good. Nobody died, therefore it's okay. <laughs> Luckily I had your seatbelt on, yeah. I mean, Timmy coach drivers, that's like a normal day for them. <laughs> this is Jeff Bus. This has nothing to do with Squirrel. This is Jeff Bus. I did not put my brand on this. Are 
Are you off for a week, Mrs. Frosty? Nice. Hi Christine, how you doing? Reminds you of our kids play their imaginary friends from mischief. Or the cat. The cat who knows where the enter key is. You've got four weeks off, Dave. What? How the heck have you wangled that? Uh, Creeper, the convoy, the Christmas convoy will be announced next Thursday. We'll announce the date and open the applications. It's in the final planning stages right now. even going the right way because I'm not getting that much attention. Uh, I see what you did there, Dr. D. You had 16 days holiday left out, you're 24. And I got extra days for work and events. What a scumbag, Dave. You maxed the system. Well, maybe, maybe, Dave, you can come down in January since you're going to be off anyway. in work time then you get paid for it <laughs> right <laughs> you got a month off work and you're still trying to wreck the system oh my god Dave I've never had yeah exactly last time I had four weeks off it was like probably at university ever since I started my work in life I've never had four weeks off Kitchen's fine. And Tiga. Uh, let's see. Quickest way to Antigua is probably up that way. So if we loop around and then take a left and then a left. Huey doesn't stand for anything. It's Tui with the first letter change. Tui. It's a travel company. Um, if you ever heard of Thompson, they kind of rebranded themselves to Tui. So they do like package holidays and stuff. They're a tour operator, basically. I think, PC Tech, I think the price of this is £30 on Steam, if I remember. Zine. I've asked for it for years. Happy 
Yeah, they do package holidays. They they have they commission their own planes. There are two e branded planes that you can fly on. This sure I'm not found almost on four years. Check we got the right way. Thank you very much, URL. Yeah, their brand logo is something like cross the T, dot the I, and put U in the middle. That's their slogan. I'm alright, Plasma, thank you. Got home after a 4 a.m. LAN party. <laughs> yeah. I've done that. I've done all night of LAN parties. Such fun. Yeah, I mean, they're pretty good, Dr. D. I've been, I've been with Tui. Me and Mrs. Squirrel went um, Tui to Gran Canaria. And uh, we went Tui to Tenerife, I think. And, you know, they're pretty good. They're very friendly staff, very helpful when you get there. Welcome Can't really fault it. I, I don't know, Dave. I honestly don't like dragging around my PC for fear of breaking it or... and then not being able to record or stream. You know what I mean? Like, if I had a mobile gaming laptop from Asus or something, then maybe I'd consider it. Or if, you know, I don't know, AlphaCool happened to have a mobile gaming laptop, then I'd consider it. Because <laughs> it would be kind of fun. What do you mean, sellouts? I, I never said anything. I never said anything. Well, what I don't do is I don't put my PC in a suitcase like some people, Langevels. <laughs> you have an Asus laptop you can lend me. Is it a gaming laptop, though? Not really PC Tech. It's more of a hint than a sellout, right? Tell you what, the AI traffic's not putting an appearance for a while. I'm getting worried. Where are we going next? To the nut house. Casillas del Angel. Where is that then? Ooh. Okay, so we go turn right out of here. Okay, we got that. Uh, next gen, welcome to the nut house. Thank you for your support. Thanks for nutty welcome, guys. Next gen, I've got to buy your tickets. Yeah, and then and then you were saying we'll buy your tickets, but you have to wear the Alpha Cool T-shirts, and then people will be like, sell out. Baltic DLC got a negative review. One of the reasons was the frequent changes of speed limits. <laughs> I love it. You gotta love the internet. I can buy you the beers, fair enough. Mind you, the rate you drink beers, Dave, I think I'll buy my own ticket. <laughs> I don't need my shift grid to automatic gearbox on the bus. Exactly, Zarek. We've got a right turn coming up down here. It's actually, because this journey's so long, the sun is actually starting to go down. Uh, 
I'm gonna change game soon, I think, to kill you. I agree with that, coaches. I mean, you could... Uh, the th Here's the thing, though, coaches. You don't get that in real life. In real life, you're driving along, and then they display the speed limit. I mean, sometimes they'll say, reduce speed limit ahead, but often they don't. But the problem is, when your map is, like, in a 1 to 20 scale, the speed limit changes can be, like, catches you out. That's the that's what they're complaining about, really. Mad Mick, good evening, squirrel. Currently doing some farming MP with the subs and feels like the old days with some of the past uh, Nuthouse farmers. Nice. Take a right here. Thank you, Mad Mick. Is a frame rate chopper? Is it stream? Um, it's it's not the stream. The frame rate gets choppy when you get near built-up areas. Right, is this the right turn here? Yeah. Unreal Engine. Same as firm bus. Yeah, they are actually Octo. The roads can be that narrow. <laughs> Annoyingly. What is it with these, like... Did you see that? The sun um, thingy. Flying around again. Failed virus, thank you for 500 bits. Lianos de la Concepcion. What the heck? Oh, it's back there. So we need to do kind of a U-turn. Uh, I've not been around much for the last half a year. Got a job working at Jet2 Dispatcher, working at uh, EGCC. Just had our profit report to release for the next six months alone. The revenue for the last six months was 2.2 million, which was up 1 billion from last year. With a profit before tax of 339 million, up 1.5 million compared to the same time last year, making us the second most successful holiday airline in the UK after TUI. I've flown with Jet2, but I only flew with them. I didn't do the package thing with them, but they were fine. I think, is it Jet2 that uses Boeing? Or is that TUI? Anyway, GG, sir, thank you. Nathan Place, 27 months. Thank you very much. You're welcome. They both use bone. Yeah, I was thinking that actually, as I said it. Look at the shadows now because the sun's going down. Interesting. It looks like it does have dynamic lighting then. Mic is weird. Why? What's wrong with the mic? <clears throat> Audio output is okay for me, I think. If you got distortion, that's got to be Twitch encoding, not me. What 
miss what pizza you're making, Bez. So I think we've got to pick them up, drop them off on one side, then loop back and pick them up on the other side, I believe. So it's anybody's guess which way we go in. Let's quickly grab this. Bag. That'll be fine. There's nobody getting off the bus anyway. Lol. Hey, what? No. You bunch of hackers. You bunch of hackers, I are disappointed. Ooh, street lighting came on. Nice. One person, is that it? Blimey. No? Yeah. Huh? 30, yeah, it's fine. Now we go back to... Cassie last and Antigua. So basically the reverse of what we just did. Yeah, the AI has not come back for a bit, actually. I'm not that upset about it, because the AI is actually quite annoying. A bit PC type, but not massively. Looks like we're going to be doing some nighttime driving here. Sun's getting pretty low. Um, PC Kelly, thank you for 27 months. What bus crossed the ocean? Columbus. Ah, third baby hype. Thank you, PC Kelly. The game looks scuffed. I don't know what that means. Never miss how you doing.
Without a sat nav, I have to guess which side of the road we're supposed to be on. That guy at the bus stop just teleported on. Missing the tip basket, lol. Where are we going next? Antigua. Okay, so we need to do a UE. People are enjoying the ETS2 DLC. Didn't it go to like number two on Steam? First place, nice. Say it's better than firm bus. Um, I think it's got more gameplay elements than firm bus, so in that respect, it's better. I'm fine, thank you, rescue. main beam apparently the lighting's looking good I like the way the sunlight's catching this side but on that side it's all dark that's really nice No, they don't complain at the moment. There is force feedback, yeah. Not a lot, though. No, the passengers are not asking for anything yet. They're not complaining yet. But I've turned on the Wi-Fi and everything. Oh, see how big foot. <laughs> right, straight south. Well, if the passengers complain, I'll just ask them to get off the bus. It 
turn off the Wi-Fi. Isn't, isn't that like talking to your kids, though? If you don't behave, I'm going to turn off the internet. <laughs> Oh boy. No, no, PC tank. The ride will be much better if you get off the bus. So, try, try Christine, do we tell him to sit on the naughty step near the back door? <laughs> Mark Bradley, I think it's £30 on Steam. Somebody mentioned a 10% discount though. Twenty five years on Aristotle, really? <laughs> 